$6 million out of their victims by using fake online romance schemes or hacking businesses. All gotten those bogus emails from a certain Nigerian prince who promises to share his vast fortune as long as you give him your bank account number. Well, investigators say these schemes are now becoming more sophisticated and expensive, costing victims in this case milk. A company's email system, impersonate company personnel, and direct payments to bank accounts that funnel money back to the fraudsters in Nigeria. Officials say those 14 people arrested are just the tip of the iceberg. 80 people in all were named in the, were named in the indictment, but most of those are overseas in Nigeria. A half a dozen suspects, though, are still on the run here in the U.S. Amy? All right, Clayton Sandell.